Weather in Kentucky is very unique. That one moment it could be 50 degrees and six hours later it could be 20 degrees snowing and ice. Um, so road conditions can change very quickly. We have to be very prepared with our equipment to, to go out and fight the elements when, uh, when the weather changes. may have uh, crews that are out working high water issues, water over the road, uh, roads, and then uh, that night after midnight uh, be in pushing snow. So, so a lot of diversity with our weather uh, from one extreme to the other. Keeping our roadways safe during snow and ice events is a joint effort between snow fighters and the public. They do their part to make sure that the roads are clear and um, mobility is maintained, but we really require the partnership of the public to help them do their jobs. materials that we use here in Kentucky, our dry material is rock salt. Uh, we do not utilize uh, sand uh, in the blend with the salt or we rely also on our liquid products, salt brine and calcium chloride. And their primary function is uh, to just prevent that bond. If we can get it down early enough to prevent that, prevent that bond uh, of the uh, snow bonding to the pavement. It's important as a motorist here in Kentucky to give the snow plow trucks uh, plenty of room to operate. Um, you know, when they're, when they're using the plow, it's, it's pushing debris out to the side. It can cover up your windshield, uh, make it very hazardous. Uh, also salt spreading, um, it'll, it'll, you know, you can throw the rock salt on your vehicle. Um, you just need to give them plenty of room to operate and do their jobs. We have a great group of operators that are involved in, in every snow and ice event that we have here in Kentucky. Uh, we're probably close to 2,000 employees that are involved at some level uh, during uh, any winter event uh, that comes through Kentucky. Uh, but our plow drivers, our snow fighters, the, the folks, the men and women that are on the front line, uh, they're, uh, they work very hard conditions, in very hard conditions as far as operating a very specialized piece of equipment. Uh, they're putting themselves in harm's way and uh, they have to deal with traffic. A lot of issues during the snow and ice is in and uh, uh, we couldn't do the job as far as the cabinet couldn't provide uh, the level of service that we provide without those folks out there fighting the snow. The biggest mistake we see out there on the roads is, you know, the driver's not giving us enough room, not giving us enough stopping distance when we're in the machines or the pieces of equipment trying to clear the roads. It makes me feel good to know that uh, the work we do helps get people to where they need to go safe. We are really fortunate to have such a dedicated crew of snow fighters here in Kentucky. These are folks that are on call. They're the ones who are facing the elements when they're at their worst. And um, they do it so that families can make it back home every night and get to the important places where they need to go. So we are, are really proud of the work that they do to really keep us all safe.